How many push-ups do you really need to build muscle? 10, 100, or none of the above? Most people either do too little and stay weak or burn out chasing numbers that don't even work. But here's the truth about push-ups. The truth, you don't need hundreds of push-ups a day to get stronger. You just need the right amount done the right way. In the next few minutes, I'll break down how push-ups actually build muscle the exact number you should do daily based on your fitness level, and why your form and recovery matter more than your rep count. Let's clear the confusion and get you real results. Each push-up isn't just a rep, it's a signal. When you push your body off the ground, you're activating your chest, shoulders, triceps, and core. This causes micro-tears in your muscle fibers, and that's good. Your body responds by repairing those tears through a process called muscle hypertrophy, building them bigger and stronger. That means if you're how many push-ups a day consistent, your push-ups aren't just burning calories, they're building real muscle mass, but only if you're doing the right amount. So how many should you be doing? First, start by finding your max. How many clean push-ups can you do in a row with perfect form? Then, follow this guide. If your max is under 25 reps, do 50 to 75 push-ups daily in two to three sets. If you can do 25 to 50 reps, do 75 to 150 reps daily in three to four sets. If you're above 50 reps, go for 150 to 250 push-ups daily across four or more sets. But don't stop there, you have to progress. Every week add five to 10 more total reps or shorten your rest time. That's called progressive overload and it's the only way to keep growing. Now, how should you? How to do push-ups be doing push-ups? Here's the truth, a 100 sloppy push-ups They'll get you nowhere, but 10 perfect ones. That's how you actually build muscle. Pay attention to your form. No sagging hips, no flared elbows, no bouncing your head up and down. Fix it with this three-step checklist. First, keep your core tight. Second, keep your body in a straight line from head to heels. Third, hands just outside your shoulders. Elbows at a 45 degree angle. Good form doesn't just prevent injuries, it accelerates your progress. Feel like you've mastered regular push-ups. Good. Now it's time to level up. Try these three muscle-boosting variations. Decline push-ups to target your upper chest and shoulders. Diamond push-ups to build serious tricep strength. Plyometric push-ups to develop explosive power and activate fast twitch muscle fibers. That's how you break plateaus and keep making gains. More push-ups doesn't mean more progress. In fact, overtraining can completely stall your gains. Muscles grow during rest, not reps. So after intense sessions, give them 48 to 72 hours to recover. Alternate heavy and light days, or stick to three to four focus sessions a week. And on rest days, walk, stretch, mobilize, because smart recovery is what makes training stick. So now you have the answer. How many push-ups you really need each day to build muscle? Enough to challenge your body done with clean, controlled form. Increase gradually over time and supported by proper rest and recovery. Don't just chase big numbers. Chase better reps, smarter plans, and steady progress. Thanks for watching.